YouTube is allowing others to make fake pages of me with my name and picture. It is really frustrating guys. So always be sure to click on my profile to check if the page is real. You can tell if my subscriber and video account is there. Do not give anyone your personal information or payment. I will never ask for payment or personal information. All payments will only be made on my website if you purchase a product. That is the only time payment is done with you guys. Please don't respond to anyone saying it's me in the comments or to random emails. Please, please be aware. Please, this is really out of hand. I'm trying to get the bottom of this with YouTube. So if you can, just be aware. Thanks, guys. Hey, are you looking to build your business credit like a boss? Well, you're in luck. I've created this awesome ebook where you can learn how to build business credit and get over $500,000 in business funding. It's on sale right now, $40 on sale. Original price is $125. I am giving you guys this at a highly discounted price. But only a hundred copies will be sold at this price. Click the link in the description below or in the pinned comments. You are already a boss, but why not get that business credit like a boss? Hey everyone, it's your girl designer so far slime back with another video. So on today's video, we're going to talk about when should you take advantage of those credit card offers that you may get in your email or mail or whenever you may get them. When you're offered a credit card, should you take advantage of it and when should you? So let's just dive right into it. So there are a few times when taking advantage of those credit card offers you receive in the mail or email makes sense. Credit cards can be a useful way to rebuild your credit or to establish new credit. Many credit card companies include benefits that might have a positive impact on your current situation. You might want to take that new credit card if you don't have any credit and you need to establish a credit history. So for instance, perhaps you're in college and would like to begin the process of establishing a positive credit history. You probably aren't in the position to purchase a car or a home with a loan. However, you may be overwhelmed with credit card offers every day. So in this instance, getting a credit card could be a great idea, but just be sure to use it responsibly and pay off your balance each month. Remember, if you're in college or very young, this is where you can accumulate a lot of debt. So you might want to take that new credit card if you require a card that's more widely accepted. So some credit cards aren't widely accepted like American Express or some of the more obscure cards. It makes sense to have a MasterCard or Visa as long as you're getting a card with good terms. These are accepted everywhere. So you may want to take that new credit card if your credit score is in the dumps and you'd like to improve it. Credit cards are an effective way to raise your credit score. Your score will improve when you have more credit available to you. So remember that one portion of your credit is the percentage of your total credit that's currently being utilized. This is how your score can increase and this is how your score can decrease. So you just want to make sure you have a low utilization when getting a credit card. You might want to take that new credit card if the interest rate on your current credit card is too high. There's no good reason to pay more interest than necessary if you have other options available to you. Search around for the best rate without ignoring those other terms. Ideally, you never want to carry a balance, then the interest rate will be irrelevant. But everyone carries a balance from time to time because an emergency happens or you just need the funds. It is what it is. But you want to just separate those type of balances and keep them low. And sometimes if you need to use other credit cards to keep that low so the interest rate doesn't rack up in fees, then you may want to take on a new credit card. The opportunity to transfer an existing balance is too good to pass up. It is not uncommon to receive offers to transfer your existing balance at 0% interest for up to 18 plus months. So this is a very great offer. I advise if there's a credit card out there that's offering this, take advantage if you need to. If you're currently having a high balance at a high rate of interest, then this could be a great move. No, this is a fantastic move. A 0% balance transfer can be a huge fine natural coup. So make sure that if you do get offered this, then you may want to take advantage of it if you have a high balance on your current credit card. The rewards offered with the credit card are worth it. This is when you want to take a new credit card. If you see a new credit card and they have rewards that you really love. If you use a credit card regularly, it makes sense to find one with a rewards program that benefits you. Some credit card offer points that can be redeemed for very 
variety of things. Some credit cards give gift cards, airline tickets, or even cash. And these are my favorite. I love when a credit card offer rewards, especially um, when you first purchase a car. If you spend, for instance, so depending on your balance, if you spend amount on that car within 60 days or 90 days, then you get cash back. And this cash can go towards your balance on your credit card, or you can use it for other things. Also, if you like to travel, a lot of credit cards give travel perks. So definitely, if you are a type of person that looking for type of perks, you will want to take out a new credit card. You will want to take that new credit card offer, you know, when it comes. So helpful tips, but please know not all of them are worth an automatic trip to the garbage can. How about checking them out, go to the website and check out what type of company is this company. Read the reviews, uh, read their perks, read what they're offering. However, one that's going to always go in the garbage is credit one so this is just my opinion and one of my favorites are the my local credit unions or credit unions or even bank of america is great chase is great discover is great these are the type of credit card companies that are great using a credit card responsibly will always improve your credit score if your credit score is quite poor a secure credit card is an option your available credit will be comparable to the security deposit you provide. Getting a new credit card isn't always a mistake. Always ask yourself whether a new credit card will harm you or improve your financial situation, okay? Using a credit card with irresponsibly can seriously damage your finances. Only acquire credit that makes sense for you. You don't need tons of credit cards, okay? Not all credit cards are created evil, but it's how you are using them. Always read the fine print. A single late payment will result in all of the accumulated interest from day one being added to your account. Remember that that interest is accumulating. Whether or not you get stuck paying interest depends on your ability to comply with the agreement of that credit card. So make sure you read the fine print on each credit card because that is ultimately how debt accumulates more. Pay attention and take care of your credit. Hey, have you heard about the charge off and collection express removal guide that I have available? A step-by-step -step guide to remove negative charge offs and collections from your credit report rapidly. These steps are easy and you don't need a credit repair company to do this. It's all step-by-step -step that you can do on your own. Check it out. It's 50% off right now. You don't want to miss out at designersobots.com or you can check the pinned comment or link in the description below to find that link. Make sure you check it out. It's 50% off right now, guys. Don't miss out. Hurry, hurry. Hi, everyone. This is Designer Soapbox. I just wanted to make this video to guys let you know that I am having a 50% off sale for 72 hours. Yes, a 50% off sale on the 24 hour express ink removal guide and also the late payment removal guide. So just head down to the description or to the pinned comments and click the link and get your 50% off. Remember, this inquiry removal will help you remove hard inquiries from your credit report within 24 hours. And then the late payment guide will um, help you remove your late payments uh, very fast, super fast actually. Um, if you're tired of disputing your late payments waiting 30 to 45 days, this is a quicker method of getting these late payments removed. So if you guys enjoyed a lot of my content, I talk about this in my videos. However, I have this in an ebook. I'm doing 50% off for you guys. If you missed a 60% off sale, I'm doing one for 50% off. So I'll see you guys in the next video. And thanks for supporting. And make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. Bye for 50 percent off so i'll see you guys in the next video and thanks for supporting and make sure you like subscribe and comment bye
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Don't forget to add me on OnlyFans, where we discuss tips and hacks that we can't post on YouTube at OnlyFans.com forward slash designer soapbox. Don't forget to add me on Instagram at designer soapbox. And don't forget to check out those ebooks that we got on sale, honey, at designer soapbox.com, where you will move your hard inquiries, late payments, collections, and more. So make sure you check that out. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And don't forget, guys, I love you all. Bye.